better than you. That's just a fact. You know, you know what? Every time I seem to make a video on this channel, I just I keep getting comments. If the vegan teacher's back, uh, Blaze, have you have you seen the vegan? Uh, Blaze, the, the vegan teacher's made a new TikTok. I, I I mean, I doubt it, guys. She's she's been she's been banned. Okay, there's just no way that she could possibly. Oh oh oh. What we do today is what matters most. Every morning. Oh okay okay. <laughs> I thought she had like really aged there for a second. I mean, she still looks quite aged, but not that bad. Now, the only real difference I think from the previous videos is now she just doesn't know how to upload at least half of her videos. Vega teacher, if you want people to react to you, which I know you do, why, why are you uploading in landscape mode? Huh? <laughs> Could you? Can you like it? Just at least make it easy for us. Well, anyway, guys, we, I, I digress. Yes, she is back. I don't know how the vegan teacher has beat the system and has now made her own TikTok account again. She clearly knows people very high up at TikTok headquarters in uh, China. But like the vegan teacher, this is a old subject to go back down. And you know what? Why not, right? It's been a while. What is she up to? Hopefully she's bettered herself. Yeah, me and you both know that's not going to be the case. I don't know why I even said that. That was a terrible intro. Hey everyone, I just want to say thank you so much for coming to my live today. We had another fun dance party. For those of you who missed it, what I do on my live sometimes is I say we're gonna have a dance party and it means we're dancing in the kitchen and there's no right or wrong way to dance and I listen to your requests. So you uh, play it, you say, hey Miss Katie, play whatever song and I ask Alexa, you know that round machine, the computer thing, I say Alexa, play a song. Oh wait, she's actually thinks I'm talking to her right now. Anyway, it was a lot of fun. We danced to each other's songs, whether we like it or not. And when I was, um, when the kids were little, that's what we used to do. Sounds like a blast. I've really been missing out, apparently. You know what, it's, it's been long enough now that uh, Vegan Teacher actually kind of has a following, right? You know, before when we'd upload videos about her, she didn't have a following back then. You know, it was just people, me, just making fun about this old lady that liked vegetables too much. <laughs> But just really been on that grind. You know that embarrassing moment when that vegan teacher li literally has a better upload schedule than me. I hate it. Hi. Well, this is actually a lie that people tell. It's not true. Some people also can't afford vegan food. <laughs> like my country is more. Exp okay. Well, you, you know what they're trying to say. I'm dyslexic, and that that made me more dyslexic. Let's hear what the vegan teacher has to say about this. It's not true. Buying vegan foods is extremely inexpensive. Now, I don't know if you're talking about going out to restaurants where you expect somebody to cook for you and do the dishes for you and all this stuff. But we at our house, we buy big bags of lentils, of chickpeas, of oats, of rice, of all kinds of different beans, and they are extremely inexpensive. You know, in many of the poorer countries, people are vegan because meat, you know, it used to be considered to be like a delicacy. You'd have like a little piece every once in a while. But you don't need to harm animals. You absolutely don't. Listen, there's a cool group on Facebook called What Broke Vegans Eat. Over on my YouTube channel, I've <laughs> They eat dogs. Okay, there's two things kind of funny about this thumbnail. One, I like to think this dog has his own channel and he went on Photoshop and created this thumbnail and I'm back. <laughs> what I eat in a day. <laughs> well, that, yeah, that sounds all very well, vegan teacher. But really, how how long can you really be eating rice and vegetables every day before you really just want to end it? Uh, apparently, I can't be the only one that thinks like that, considering vegans like to copy everything that tastes like meat. I remember when I made a video on trying like the, the vegan stuff for the first time. That was expensive. <laughs> like, for for some cheese, vegan cheese was like six pounds. That's like 10, 10 US dollars, nearly. Yeah, it did, did not taste very nice. No, don't do it. It's a trap. You know what, as well, while, while browsing through this, it's just nice to know that Bella the dog is still alive and she's doing okay. You know what, guys, that, that makes me, that deserves a like within itself. I mean, the... Doesn't, doesn't grass make like dogs puke? My girl Bella so hungry she has resorted to eating grass in the back garden. I thought that I thought the dog died. Unless she just my conspiracy is she just keeps buying a new Bella each year. It's either that or Bella's like battery powered or something. There's no way this is a real dog. Didn't you do? Yeah, Bella. Didn't you do?
Nice to know she makes uh, TikToks that make me feel just as uncomfortable as they did before. She hasn't changed a bit, guys. Vegans are better than you, that's just a fact. They don't pay for murder, that's just how they choose to act. Yeah, vegans are better than you. You gotta face it, cause it's true. You hear that, guys? Vegans are... They're, they're just better than you. Better than me. Be better than you. They don't just talk about this now. They literally tell us in singing form. Responding to comments today, and here's what you say. You say you're going to be vegan, which is amazing. Well, I just like to think people watch this video. Uh, yeah, that was, that, that was the final push I really needed. I was kind of on the fence for a while, but after watching this, I think I'm going to do it. Are beans vegan? Of course! Black beans, kidney beans are good for your heart. The more you eat, the more you fart. The more you fart, the better you feel. Cause you're saving animals with every meal. Go vegan! I feel like around about this time, we should uh, clarify that the vegan teacher is in fact 56 years old. I want you to let that sink in for a second. This is literally someone's mother. I also like to think that a uh, vegan teacher's son or daughter, whoever they may be, just watches vegan teacher cringe on TikTok and YouTube. Y you think, you think they do that? Or even better yet, I actually bet they run one of the pages. Uh, look how many, like when you type up vegan teacher, look, just look how many pages there are. <laughs> Guys, this is ridiculous. Still this many pages and still no meat teacher. Guys, I'm disappointed in you. I mean, this literally just goes on for days. That's why when you guys said to me the other day, Ablaze, that vegan teacher is back. I didn't believe you. I just didn't think it could be true. Follow that vegan teacher on YouTube for music, interviews, and more. We've got ourselves a little entrepreneur here, guys. There we go. That's better. I think that just better describes what the vegan teacher is really selling. She needs to understand her audience here, guys. She doesn't know what she's got. Also, just quickly, I, I really couldn't help but notice this weird kind of story that vegan teacher has made up on the spot, right? I, I just want to inform you guys because it's been a little bit of a while, right? We need some updates on the vegan teacher lore. So I I'm just scrolling across her TikTok right now. It's still pretty weird, still pretty cringe. And then, and then I come across the string of uh, TikToks. Now, I, I don't know if uh, vegan teacher was, had a bit too much uh, broccoli that day, but she, she's, uh, <laughs> hmm. She'd be acting a little bit, little bit different there, guys. Queen Cheryl? And her husband? They're having a baby? I wonder, if she's vegan yet. Cheryl, <gasps> I wonder who the surrogate is. I wonder if she's vegan yet. So, we're off to a pretty weird start, right? Well, I thought so too. But then you might want to sit down for the next one, guys, because uh, when I tell you this is a video that I would never have thought I would see the vegan teacher ever do. I do oh, look, okay, whoa, whoa. <laughs> a little, little bit of a teaser there. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, but do you see that? What 1.1 views? Buckle in. You know, you know we're in for a good video. <gasps> Right, so there's a few things to unpack here. One of them being my eyes. I want to unpluck them from the socket and pour them in bleach after seeing that. Second of all, the vegan teacher gave birth to a Minecraft pig. Right, you know what? I'm pretty amazed. I would have thought out of all the years of training I had on making vegan teacher videos, nothing could have prepared me for watching that. You know those things where you click on something and you think to yourself, I, I wonder if there's a way or some type of therapy I could do that could help me unsee that. Instead, I recorded it. I edited it. And I put it on a YouTube video just for you guys. You are more than welcome. I'm not forcing you to be vegan. I'm just telling you to stop paying for murder and to eat your vegetables. So basically forcing us to be vegan. Guys, listen. Okay. I'm not forcing you to n stop eating meat. But uh, if you could stop buying it and also eat vegetables right now. Thank you. Welcome to your vegan muscle minute class. Time to get up and move your ass. Here's your alphabetized vegan shopping list. Memorize it so nothing will be missed. Let's why, do, why do I feel like I'm watching some weird DID video right now? I, we're not. We are on the vegan teacher's TikTok. Don't get it twisted. But I feel like I'm watching a 12 year old right now stimming for the first time. <laughs> I can see how you guys like the new content that I transitioned from Vegan Teacher. It's quite, it's quite similar. I see the similarity. Cracking bone sounds. Start with the letter A. Okay. Okay. 
Apples, asparagus, avocado, bananas, beans, carrots, cucumbers, dates, edamame, beans, eggplant, it's fenugreek, fruit of any kind, green beans, hemp seed, hummus, ice cream. You know, something that's really been on my mind as well, and if this video gets 10,000 likes, I'll definitely consider it. There needs to be that meat teacher, okay? There's clearly a gap in the market for vegan teachers' rival to come onto TikTok as that meat teacher. I, I'm just saying there's clearly a gap and I'm, I'm willing to fill that gap at a price. 10,000 likes to be exact. And then I will do jumping jacks while going through the alphabet, naming all the meats. Angus beef, ahi tuna, abalone, adobo chicken, anchovy. Guys, consider it. It's, it's a pretty low price. First of all, I want to say thank you for being here. And thank you for your question. Instead of just assuming, you're asking. I wonder though if you should just maybe ask your friend what she heard. But anyway, thanks for coming to me. So no, I don't make fun of any communities. What I do though, is I tell everyone that they should strive to be vegan. You know, the LGBTQ community are just as kind and compassionate as anyone else, no matter what your skin color, religion, no matter what your age, your size, Everyone can strive to hurt animals less. Guys, I find this very false information. Vegan teacher is clearly against the meat community, okay? She's she's against us. <laughs> While drinking some of Shrek's yummy yummy smoothie, she is standing here against us. Lies. These are all lies. Why does this bird also look like Boris Johnson? That I use for all sort of cleaning purposes and it's blue. That's all I know. It's you know what I mean? No, vegan teacher, we, we don't know what you mean. But some people don't like that. So they say, oh, she's prejudiced or oh, she's racist. And they make all of these different comments. But the truth is that I'm just here to defend the animals. By the way, did you have your green smoothie yet today? This one has spinach in it and banana and you can't even taste the spinach. That was information I didn't really need to know. Thanks, vegan teacher. We're strong, we're happy, we're healthy, and we're proud to be on the right side of history. Happy, we're healthy, and we're proud to be on the right side of Vegan teacher after she literally dances for more than 30 seconds. Anyway, boys and gals, wasn't that fun? I had a great time. Who would have known we could have actually had fun watching vegan teacher videos? I suppose that's probably what happens though when I'm not making daily vegan teacher videos anymore. You can kind of enjoy them somewhat. Honestly, I would say I'm sad that she's back on TikTok, but I'm, I'm really not. It, it kind of does just give me more content. So I really can't even complain at this stage. But anyway, boys and gals, what do you think? Let me know. Should she just be instantly banned again would you like to see more of the videos that she uploads i think she uploads like five times a day like i said the, the vegan teacher grind is for some reason very real let me know in the comments down below and uh i'll see you all in the next video uh, goodbye my children hugs and kisses B bye bye